The only two bicep exercises you'll ever need. Alright, so when you're doing bicep curls, you don't want to grab out here. You don't want to grab in there either. And reason being is because you don't want to put your joints in an awkward position. With you putting joints in an awkward position, one, you're not gonna feel good, it's gonna feel awkward when you're doing it, and two, you're not gonna be making as effective gains as you possibly would if you grab it right here in the middle where your wrist, your bicep, and your shoulder are aligned. And which, therefore, you'll be maximizing the amount of bicep gains that you make from your long head and your short head, which is what you truly want. And just by this alone, right here, this exercise, as long as you're doing it properly, You'll actually be able to max out your biceps over the years. At the end of the day, you want to have big biceps and not have baby biceps. So, when you're doing bicep curls, you want to maximize the elbow flexion, which is doing this. But, a lot of people, when they're tired or when they don't know what they're doing, they usually go like this. You ease off of the elbow flexion, but you're not loading your bicep effectively if you do that, and you start using shoulder flexion. And with shoulder flexion, you start activating your anterior delt, and that's not the whole purpose of this. The whole purpose of this is to maximize the load that's going onto your bicep to intensify the hypertrophic stimulus that you get out of the exercise. Otherwise, what's the point of doing it if you want to do it wrong? And of course, if you are doing cheat reps, that's a whole different story. But if you're not doing cheat reps, then why are you doing it wrong in the first place? Do it right, and you'll make the best gains out of this. So, we're going to be doing Zotman curls. And the reason why this is one of the best exercises you can possibly do to develop your arms is because you use your short head, your long head, and you use your brachialis. For most bicep exercises, you don't really use your brachialis. So this is one of the best ways to do it.